Woo! What's up, everybody? Swag train back on the mic for another episode of Let's Play Persona 5 Royal. Last time, Futaba officially joined the party. And as we can see, there she is. Um, something. Let me actually make sure I save up to this point. Because I didn't last time, at the end of the last recording, I didn't save. And so I had to go back and skip the skip to get nice. to this point. Minus the minor dialogue change, we didn't really do much. But now we're just going to keep doing what we've always been doing. And I think, instead of listening to confidence, I think I'm going to grind up some social stats right now. Because, um, we are kind of behind. And I don't, I think behind's the right word, but I think we could get a little further. So. I have no idea how far I am from improving my guts. And I want to get my guts up at some point, especially when guts is kind of the hardest social stat for you to rank out. We have a Guts DVD, fortunately, oh. so let's finish watching this one. And we will get a deeper appreciation. Well, where's the manuscript? Can't do this. <laughs> but yeah, Guts is kind of hard for us to write up, especially you gotta go out of your way to improve it, so... The editor demanded a manuscript, but the writer only hung his head in defeat. For real? This is no time for writer's block! How is he gonna make the deadline? Oh. So we finished watching 31, huh? We were pressed for time ourselves, but we made it. Maybe you learned a thing or two about guts. I did. Okay. Let's go return the DVD okay. soon. All right. I will take my guts. Thank you. I never expected what happened to Futaba's mother would be connected to those incidents in the city. We can't leave this be. Now what's gotten into you, dude? Well, this is truly our time to shine. Though this scoundrel has the same power as us, they're triggering people's mental shutdowns if they truly exist. Who can stop them? Only us. This is getting interesting. Yeah, you seem fired up. We've got a new addition to the team, so it's time I flex my veteran skills. And Morgana seems awfully excited, doesn't he? Hey, we need to talk. Come downstairs. Come downstairs! Hey, get ready. We're going up. So, you want me to come? You don't have any plans, right? Just come on. It'll be my treat. Not only can Futaba go out now, but your summer break's almost over. We gotta do something. Especially for sushi, you better be thankful. This place is supposed to be super delicious, too. Is this supposed to be Ginza? Sushi? Take me with you! I didn't get to eat the takeout sushi last time, remember? Man, that thing never stops meowing, does it? Nope. He's demanding sushi. Tell him to bring me along! <laughs> Wait, does it want to come with us or something? I do feel sorry for it, though. Well... I guess I don't mind bringing some sushi home. All right. He knows me so well. Let's see. I want some medium fat tuna, fatty tuna, salmon roe, anago, and and oh, are you going to be able to remember all this? You might want to take notes. <laughs> sure. Whatever. So, how is it? Good? I'd say so. She chowing down on that sushi. Mm. Don't wolf it down like that. It, look, no one's gonna take your food. <laughs> what did I tell you? Drink some tea. <coughs> Restroom! Huh? Oh, oh restrooms. Uh, they're that way. <laughs> <laughs> what a busy girl. Yeah. Back in the day, she, her mother, and I used to go eat out often. This brings back memories. I had completely forgotten about it, too. Mm. I was close. I thought I was gonna die. Well, time to resume. Really? You're still going to eat? Uh, I'm all 
mouthful. I'm throwing in the towel. Oh, good lord. <laughs> Which is it? I'm gonna use the restroom and then pay the bill. All right. Uh, check, please. Coming right up. When I got into middle school, my mom and Sojiro took me out to eat sushi to celebrate. That sushi was so good. Was it this sushi? This was pretty good too. I hope the three of us can come again sometime. Yeah, me too. When should we do this again? I wish she could have had today's sushi too. <sighs> I want to find out what happened to mom. I won't forgive the guy who triggered her mental shutdown. So, you better help me out. Oh, I will. 120,000 yen? You're joking, right? <laughs> Uh-oh. Looks like we won't be getting sushi to go. Nope, we won't. Hm, hold on a minute. Welcome home. I've been waiting for you. Huh? Wait, where's my sushi? Where's my fatty tuna? Where's my inago? Oh no. That sushi was so delicious. We even had the cat share. Probably Sojiro had more money. So that's why. <laughs> Poor cat. I do kind of feel bad for Mona though. All the cat wants is some sushi. Hmm. There's actually one place I want to go more than sushi. Any idea what it is? A ramen shop. Ooh, watching out on sushi with some ramen? That sounds stylish, but we can do that another time. I want to go to Akihabara. I want to buy a game, but I'm scared to do it. You think you can help? Oh yeah. You're a nice guy. It's late, so let's just get over there. Wait, we're meeting in Akihabara? Mm-hmm. Is Futaba really going to be okay? We'd better get over there. Oh yeah. Right. Now I go to Akihabara. Is this where we're supposed to be meeting? My eyes are bothering me. Good lord. Is she not here? Try checking around. Are you all by yourself? Where did you come from? <laughs> I... Hey, over there. Did you run away from home? What's wrong, little girl? Uh, 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 mm -mm. That looks bad. What are you gonna do? Yeah, let's help. Yeah, hurry up. Uh, well, can you come down to the station with me for now? Huh? Uh, hey! Do you know this girl? Yeah, uh, she's family. You're not lying, are you? Very well. Please know what's just doing his job, honestly. Utaba, are you okay? S sorry, I thought I conquered my fears back at the beach. What happened? There wasn't anyone I knew with me, so I panicked. Felt like my heart was gonna pop. I got so scared all by myself. Then I just sort of curled up into a ball. Then all these people started staring at me, and the police came, and then it was all over. Look, Futaba, if you're ever in trouble, just call this guy. Okay. Yep. Mm. I feel kind of calm when we're this close. You're okay being like this, right? Are you a Remora? Maybe. <laughs> Couldn't even go by a game by myself. I'm a failure. Futaba. But I'm okay outside as long as it's with him. Is he some kind of key item? Please, be my key item. I'll try and get better at navigation if you do. Uh, sounds good. For reals? <laughs> then it's a deal. You should accompany Futaba when she goes out from now on. We were impressed with the intel gathering skills of the Phantom Thieves as well. We also know that this would have been impossible unless you had a skilled hacker. Who was doing this? Uh, somebody. I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast acquired. 
acquired a new vow. It shall become the wings of rebellion that breaketh thy chains of captivity. With the birth of the hermit persona, I have obtained the winds of blessing that shall lead to freedom and new power. Oh, moral support. All right. Chance to cast Kajum. Conjure or party heal and magic during battle. All right, now that that's over with, let's go. Where? Need by game. Oh boy. Weren't you bawling your eyes out just a second ago? Yeah, but I have my key item now. <laughs> Victory conditions met. Come on, let's roll. Welcome home. Where were you two? Akihabara. Yep. What? That's incredible, Futaba. I... I guess. I just hope you can keep that up. Maybe you'll even be able to go to high school someday. Yeah. Oh boy, sore spot. Well, that's enough of that. I bet you're exhausted after dealing with all those people, huh? Let's get you to bed. Hey, we're gonna head back. And so is your Futaba, what hope? Whoa, this approval reading's insane! It's over 60% now! Aw, you're making me blush! I'm not talking about you! No, this is definitely thanks to Futaba silencing Medjet. See? How about that? It's kind of frightening how strong the momentum is. Who cares? Why the cold shoulder? These people are cheering for us. Uh, yeah, but don't let the hype get to your head. That's where we get in trouble, alright? Everyone's got high expectations for the Phantom Thieves. Let's make sure they're answered. On top of that, this case has shed light on something important. I mean, that criminal. Well... I suppose at this point we could refer to them as the one behind the mental shutdowns. That's the person who killed my mom. We can't leave them be. Let's talk more. Let's talk more in detail about this at school. All right. And so tomorrow starts school. So. No sushi, and we got dragged around by Futaba. What a terrible day. The Phantom Thieves have become amazingly popular. Tons of people have started accessing the forum too. Anyway, I was thinking about how I could make use of the spike in popularity, and I decided to add a new web function to the website. Hmm? Are you curious? It'll send people's wishes directly to you guys. I hope you're excited. It'll be up and running tomorrow. Ugh! Can't believe I have to leave Japan now of all times. Don't you know? It's almost time for the school trip. In any case, look forward to the new function. Hmm. Nice. So, school trip, huh? I think we're stuck in the cafe, right? Yep. So I think this is going to be a good opportunity for us to read. Hey. So, hey. let's read. Let's read this book. Have the guts. I will gladly take some more guts. A heart without hesitance is the essence of Bushido. Mm. Learning about the spirit of the samurai seems useful, but this book looks difficult. Oh. And we can keep going. A heart that never backs down is the secret to Bushido. <laughs> we still got more. Seems like you're getting through that book quickly. That guide on speed really helped. How'd you go? How far'd you get? And we still have pages left. Yeah, I think I may um, focus some more on Guts here. And then I think after we get closer to Guts... I think I'm gonna put some time back into knowledge, cause good lord. Listen up, inmate. Our master wants a word with you. We're behind on knowledge. <laughs> it seems you formed a contract with another new ally. This is the owner of quite a different type of power. It will mm -hmm. help guide you all to further heights as thieves. So, what now? <laughs> Worry not. You are steadily approaching the realization of your goal. This is not necessarily to prove so. But I shall increase the number of personas you can hold at once. 
Oh, From here on, thank you. Your tail will make great progress. Hone your powers even further and prepare for the time that will soon come. I expect great things from you. Now we can have 12 personas in our right. arsenal. Nice. Until we meet again. It is time, inmate. Return to your world. And here we go. Morning. Sup? Ooh, a uniform. What? Doesn't look weird. You look great, surprisingly. Futaba says she's going to shift to living a morning person's life. A healthy mission starts with a healthy lifestyle. Yep. Mission. Here we go. And on to breaking news. In regard to the so-called Phantom Thieves events that have been a hot topic among the general public, the Prime Minister held a press conference at his official residence to address the problem. The government acknowledges the current rumors of the group called the Phantom Thieves. We are currently confirming facts with the police and wish to deal with it in an appropriate... Even the Prime Minister's talking about the Phantom Thieves? They're allies of justice, after all. They change hearts, huh? wonder if it's true. <laughs> Looks like we're finally being recognized across the country. Yep. But stay calm, all right? Even though you have ambitions, you remain cool, hmm? I bet you stole that from me. Let's find clues on that case as soon as we can, too. And resolve it ourselves, for Futaba's sake, too. You two really get along, don't you? Most of the time. You're be late if you don't get going soon. Good luck on your student duties. All right, thank you. The age group with the most belief in the Phantom Thieves seems to be teenagers. We've even received messages about how the Phantom Thieves are all students talk about these days. Do you know about them? They're the only thing my daughter speaks to me about. She's been glued to this fan site thing. I thought it was just an ordinary website. Lately, they've added a polling feature to ask who you'd like to see have a change of heart. Given people's heightened expectations, it's been receiving a lot of votes. Huh. Maybe I should go vote for our company president. Change his heart so he'll raise our salaries. Sounds pretty good, doesn't it? That's cheap. That's not a good reason to change someone's heart. Oh, it's all over. I can't believe school is starting up again. Not like I did anything during summer break. I just stayed in and played online games. The Phantom Thieves are great! Nothing you could have done this summer would have topped the Phantom Thieves. Hacking Medjed back and all the other stuff was totally nuts. Everyone online was waiting for the deadline to hit. People sure do love the Phantom Thieves. Speaking of, have you checked out the fan site recently? They added a bunch of new stuff, including the option to rank people to get a change of heart. Herbs already started. I think this every year, but isn't summer vacation too short? Eh, we were busy though. I guess it depends on how you look at it. We kind of got to visit Egypt in a way. In a sense. <clears throat> All right, let's begin homeroom. Let's see. We've just gotten back from vacation, but starting next Monday is the school trip. Wait, what? This makes no sense. Why would you be coming back from summer vacation for like five days, only to go on like a school trip the next week? Oh yeah, that's right. I don't quite get the scheduling. Our students are so lucky. We get an entire month off for summer and get to go to Hawaii too. Make sure that none of you cut loose too much, okay? No promises. Okay, settle down. That concludes homeroom. A school trip, huh? I guess we won't be able to act as phantom thi- <laughs> Takamaki-san! You can speak English, right? Basically, yeah. That's amazing. I lived over there, so it's nothing that special. Hey, if there's something we're not sure of in English, can we ask you about it? Huh? 
all people are talking about in my class is the Phantom Thieves. That's a, is it the same for you? Talk about being popular. Anyway, now that the new semester started, let's have another operational meeting. the answer in this context the nuance of the idiom is the complete opposite I saw a lot of errors on the previous test so please be more careful in the future hey excuse me no sleeping in class today's examples will be on your practice entrance exams so make sure you know them what's up with Kawakami she usually looks so tired I talked to her this morning about my future and she was super polite friendly even yeah I know what you mean she even gave me advice about my girlfriend yes Yes! Kawakami's back on her feet. Now, we can max out her confidant. Hmm. There you guys are. Utaba! Did you come here by yourself? I went together since I got out of school early. What a patronizing Inari. <laughs> that wasn't patronizing, it was the truth. Chill. Well then, let's get talking. What do we do now? Should we go after another big target? Should we calm down about it's that? important too, but what about that villain in the cognitive world? Also, is this the best place to be talking about this? It's almost certain that this person exists. What's more, they're inducing mental shutdowns. We certainly can't turn a blind eye. <sighs> yeah, but we don't got any clues. But, you know how we're toads popular right now? Everyone at school's talking about us. And not a day goes by when you don't hear about it on TV either. We totally made it big, don't you think? True. The rankings on the Phantom Aficionado website have been crazy, too. You mean this? Huh? What the hell? First place keeps changing by the second. People are voting around the clock, after all. Hmm. If we go after these guys, I'm sure we'll score some big cash at least once. What would you use money like that for? An extravagant spree. Why not? Ooh, yeah! Like, enjoying food across the world? I do that. Are you fine with that, Futaba? Even though it's related to what happened to your mother. It's not okay. I'm definitely gonna punch that guy. The culprit forcing mental shutdowns. If you think about it, there's no bigger target than that. If we can change his heart and get a confession out of him, we'll be on top of the world for real. Should we reveal our identities then? Oh, I bet chicks are gonna be all over us. Ryuji, priorities. Whoa, whoa. You want us to show our faces? I guess that might be okay. I see. If the true culprit confesses the existence of the metaverse will become known, there would be no need for us to remain in hiding in such a questionable manner. Dude, that's actually a good point. Like, Juicy actually brings up a good point. I, I wouldn't reveal our identities right now, but once we solve the mental shutdown case, like if we solve the mental shutdown case, then the person committing all these mental shutdowns has a change of heart. The metaverse is going to be what? Well, worldly known, so there's no point in keeping ourselves secret at that point. Hey, we're not doing this to stand out, you know. <laughs> and we're not doing that either, so. Being unknown is the allure of being a phantom thief. But considering the hype now, it's gonna be one hell of a huge deal if we pull it off. Are there really no clues regarding those mental shutdown cases? If I remember right, wasn't the older Nijima sister investigating it? Yes, I can pry and ask about it. But she'll just tell me to mind my own business and get angry with me. Oh yeah, because Ty's a bitch. If you can't ask her, wanna just extract that data? Does she have a personal laptop or something? Don't tell me. Yep. I can lend you a storage device with my special gimmick on it. Just Ooh. stick this baby in and it'll clone the internal hard drive. It'll even bypass the OS password. You'll have to plug it directly into her laptop though. Can you do it? This does bring her laptop home sometimes, but I'm not comfortable going that far. Ooh, is Futaba gonna do something amazing again? Are you scared of seeing how your sister truly feels? No! Yes. Of course not. She is. That hesitation Fine, says volume. I'll do it. Speaks volumes, I should say.
What? I was in a tabloid magazine? But I gave a gag order in regard to Mr. Kamashita's case. Please, wait! Please give me some time! I will find evidence on the Phantom Thieves for sure! I couldn't have made it this far had it not been for your assistance, sir. Please, please let me... Your days are numbered! That's what I feel uh, like. No! No! <sighs> Summer's over already, huh? It's went by too fast. Still another six months ahead of you. Keep yourself in check, got it? These rankings are insane! Yes, if you look away for even a single moment, the order changes completely. It's hard to decide who to actually go after. They're flooding in. We can choose anyone we want. We should wait for now, though. It'll, it will surely cool off soon. More importantly, how are things on your end, Makoto? Sis isn't home yet. She might not come back at all tonight. Man, just how thin could be if we can narrow down our targets. That's true, but aren't you guys taking this a little too lightly? All the pressure here rests on me. I'm, we're counting on you, though. Even you, Shadow? I suppose I'll do it. Let's leave this to Makoto. I'm sure she'll be able to pull it off. Hey, hey! Now, what to do? Um, Sojiro. I think I want to go to Akihabara, though. I think I want to go here. Let's see. There's the arcade. Uh, crane game. Uh, nah. I think I'm gonna go get a game here or two. And there's one on the way at the end here. Star Fornius? Yep. Oh, Fornius badge. Made a decision. Let's see. Charm and proficiency we don't need, so. I will take knowledge, and I will take guts. Uh, that's what I'll take. And I think we could hang out with. Oh yeah, I think we're gonna hang out with Sergio though, just so I can get his confidant gated because we need rank five kindness in order to keep going. So make sure there's no crossword puzzle. Nope. You have time today, right? How about the cafe? Uh. Thanks. Sorry. Thanks. Ray will be here any minute. Don't you ever get lonely, Sochan? Have you been a bachelor for you've been a bachelor for so long? Have you given up on marriage? <laughs> All I want in a relationship is spicy stimulation followed by some smooth, relaxing comfort. And I can get both of those things from my curry and my coffee. So that's for me. What are your thoughts on Sochan's life of solitude? I admire it. <laughs> you can admire me if you want, but I don't recommend trying to follow in my footsteps. Anyway, the only thing I care about in life is making sure my customers are satisfied. Nothing makes me happier than seeing people relaxing here. Come back anytime, time, okay? Hey. You seem especially aggressive today, huh? Would've been bad if she pushed any further. But I guess food service relies on keeping people the right distance from, the right distance from people. Not too far, not too close. Welcome. <clears throat> you just don't know when to give up, do you? Well, I just learned something very interesting. Futaba's been shut off from the, from both school and society this whole time, huh? That's not good parenting. Yeah, and what have you done to care for her? You know quite well what I've done. It's about time you pay up. <sighs> don't be ridiculous. Futaba had a terrible life living with you. Plus, I already gave you most of the inheritance for custody. Is that still not enough for you? You can always find out in court. I wonder who'd win between a blood relative and a mere, mere legal guardian. Ooh. Oh, not to mention that kid you have there. I heard all, all about him and his criminal record. That leaves us with a parent who let, let her go to school, who won't let her go to school, and a delinquent housemate on probation. Doesn't quite seem to be the best environment for Futaba, now does it? Uh, shut the fuck up, sir. You have a problem, punk? I'll sue you for intimidation. Hey, keep your neck out of this. Just get on upstairs, okay? 
Sojiro! I hunger! <sighs> oh. Futaba-chan! Long time no see! I... 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 Futaba! See what I'm saying? She's a total wreck! This is clearly not a healthy situation. She's only like this because she saw you here! Don't make me repeat myself. You can't beat me in court, so you may as well just give me the money. Son of a bitch. That son of a bitch. Futaba, you should just head home for today. I'll take you. Sojiro. <sighs> Futaba's okay. All that drama must have tired her out. She fell asleep right after we got home. That man is Futaba's uncle. After Wakaba died, Futaba was passed around all her relatives. His place was the last. He treated her like garbage. He never fed her or forced her to sleep on the floor like an animal. He didn't even let her bathe. Once I learned that, I knew I had to step in. I couldn't stand for that kind of horrible treatment, so I decided to take Futaba under my care. Even back then, he was whining about all the damn expenses. He was some cash this way, thinking up with the issue in bed. Now he's back for more. I don't even know how he managed to find me here. Maybe paying him was a mistake. What are you talking about? Saving Futaba was no mistake. <laughs> Thanks. I never thought you'd be the one comforting me. Either way, though, it's my fault Futaba didn't leave her room. I just didn't know how to help her through it. I'd make curry, leave her by the door, and go. If not for you, I'd probably still be waiting for her to come out. So if you asked me whether I deserved to be Futaba's guardian, my answer would be no. They say blood's thicker than water, right? I wonder what would be best for Futaba. Staying with you! And that's the best. Sorry. Look at me, spilling my heart out to a punk like you. Though, it's kinda weird. For some reason, I just feel like telling you this stuff. It's like you're peering into my heart. <laughs> Guess there is something special about you. Coffee master. All right. Now we can make some real good coffee. It's pretty late already. I'm going home. I should be heading home. I'm still worried about Futaba. Don't stay up too late, you hear? Oh, and thanks. More kindness. All right. Level four. Still not quite there yet. Hey. Futaba's fast asleep. Didn't mean to get you tangled up in all this mess. Can I help somehow, though? <laughs> no. You don't have to do anything. The fact you asked is enough. Man, though. I never know what I'm doing when I'm talking to you. I just keep y yammering on about stuff I never planned on talking about. Must be the going smile, huh? Don't worry about that guy. I'll find some way to deal with him. You just keep looking out for Futaba. Seems like you two are really hitting it off, so... That's all I had to say. Don't forget to lock up before bed. Later. Alright, dude. Huh. Did you get a tan? You seem different. Oh, yes. Thank you for the coffee last time. It is a lovely cafe. I haven't relaxed that much in a while. Oh, come again. That's nice of you to say. Especially lately, since it seems I'm hated by those who support the Phantom Thieves. Anyhow, it seems your school's in trouble. The media is reporting that the whole school was involved in the cover-up about that gym teacher. Those unfortunate students were made victims. All because adults valued their own conveniences. This is unforgivable. No matter the reason. Let me know if you need anything. I'll do my best so that the case is wrapped up quickly. All right, then. Hey! Those are students, Shujin students, right? I read an article about Shujin in a magazine. High school horrors, a school-wide cover-up. It seems like the administration turned a blind eye to that abusive teacher. It's all so hard to believe. The principal claimed he didn't know what was going on at first. We're talking about children's lives. People like him are the ones who should answer for this. <sighs> don't like the way they're looking at us. Yeah, I don't either. What up? What's up? See that ad in the train? I did. 
Media is going to show up at school again. Cover up by faculty and principal of Shujin Academy, where the Phantom Thieves first appear. It's been a huge deal already. I wonder what's going to happen to the principal now. Anyways, we made the right choice going after big targets. Everywhere I go, people are talking about us. Dude. Whoa. Oh, there's cutest girl. There we go. Uh, I'm sorry. Hello. Oh, no, I'm fine. That girl just now, don't you think she was fine? Cute as fuck? Absolutely. The Phantom Thieves are on fire right now, so I wonder if I got a chance if I asked her out? No. <laughs> no. It sucks that uh -uh. I can't just say I'm actually a Phantom Thief to anybody. Uh-uh. Did you do it too, Teach? The whole cover-up thing? This is the first time I'm hearing about it too. Even if the police ask you anything, you better not make irresponsible comments to them. Seriously, why does this keep happening? All my relatives are gonna call me again. Uh-oh. Oh, perfect timing. I think you might have been told this already, but it's about the school trip. You know how the police have been coming to the school again because of that incident? So, a number of the senior faculty are going to be called in for questioning, and that day just happens to overlap with the school trip. Mm -hmm. Yes, I've been told so. Now, this came up at the faculty meeting, but the plan is to have third years to act as our proxies. I'm so sorry to drop this on you, Nijima-san, but we'll be counting on you. What? <laughs> you know, a lot of the second years this year happen to be... unique. You must have your hands full with the entrance exams, but I'm sure you'll be fine with your grades. Don't worry. There'll be a couple more people going besides you. If that's the case, very well. Really? Oh, thank goodness. I'll go ahead and pass this news on then. Okay. I guess that works out. Listen this time. Okay? Tabloids have been all over it. You might have some concerns, but we're going to do things as usual. I heard the school was in on it and tried to hide it. Were the teachers involved in the scandal too? I had nothing to do with it! Do you really think I have that much power? Okay, that's enough chit chat. If you're that worried, you can always see our school counselor. Starting today, we'll have Dr. Maruki on call. We want to we want we went to the trouble of getting him, so don't be afraid to ask. And the new semester's barely started and things are already getting crazy. Oh yeah, ain't that the truth. You guys see? Akechi showed up in the rankings. Perhaps it's due to the negative comments he made about us. Seems that way. God, this is freaking amazing. Meh. I'm not trying to, I'm trying not to let the hype get to my head. Ooh, someone's all cool and uninterested. How's it going, Makoto? You can do your sister's daddy yet? I think she's been busy. She didn't come home at all yesterday. That is problematic. What are we gonna do? We can't do a damn thing until we get that. Everyone in school's been on edge since that tabloid article. Please be careful not to say that, okay? You don't gotta tell me hey, twice! Are you listening? Oh boy. Phew! We have max proficiency, so we don't have to worry about more chalk thrown at us. Hey! And we don't need the extra charm, but we'll take it. Now, if only we can max up the other stats. You remember our deal? How I was supposed to help you with physical training? You think we could put that on hold for next week? I'm going to a training camp, so I'll be out of Japan for a while. I'm out too, huh? Oh right! The second years go ne next week too. What a coincidence! They're both going overseas at the same time, huh? Then training's on hiatus until we both get home. Alright, fine. Hmm. Now we have options. I think we're gonna spend some time with Futaba though. We are at rank for kinda, so that means we have another social link we can officially start, but beforehand. Let's go to the library. 
I don't know why I went this way. Oh, this what works. would you like? Oh, guts. Here. Here. Hey, are you free? I am. All right, fine. She's in front of level one. All right. What's up? What's up? Yo. Yo, Shadow. That's right. Um. Well, sorry about what happened in Akihabara. I really messed up. We should be able to come for Futaba because we're selfless. Uh, Just take things slowly. I guess you're right. I mean, I still managed to buy some stuff after that, but that was only because you were there. Anyways, um, can we go up to your room? I'll talk some more. All right. Let's go, Shadow. <laughs> Akihabara was lots of fun. I think I want to try going somewhere else next time. It really sounds like Soder wants me to go back to school. But online classes are better for studying. I won't even have to leave the house. But would that solve anything? Uh, you're probably right. Just studying by myself is way different from actual school. School. Um. To be honest, I really do want to go back. Do you think I'll be able to? Hey, if we work together, then yeah. Yes. Yeah. I... I'm gonna do my best. Oh, that's right! I should make a promise list! My mom used to have me do that all the time. She'd write down all my goals for the month, like cleaning the house or running errands for her. Then when I'd finish one, she'd mark it off with a big stamp. She always used to write comments, too. <laughs> Those were the best. Oh, and once I finished all my goals, she would take a day off of work to spend time with me. All right. I'm gonna make a promise list. Time to get my ideas ready. Mm -hmm. All done! So, these are my promises. Go somewhere with lots of people. Getting used to crowds is key. Go to school. I want to see what the inside of a normal high school looks like. Three, learn more, 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 more about my generation. And have a normal conversation with a stranger my mm. age. How's that? That's good to me. Settled. I'm not setting a deadline for this, by the way. I'm gonna try to finish all of them someday. You're gonna have to help me, though. I'll work even harder with my navigation in return. All right. All right. Memento scan. Um. If I finish all the promises, do you think I could have a reward? I know it's kind of weird to ask, but having a reward waiting at the finish line will only will totally push me onward. I got this. Though I'm kind of exhausted from making in the list, so tomorrow. I got this tomorrow. Okay. I'm gonna make like a hedgehog and roll out of here. So you're gonna do the spin dash. Alright. Do Sonic signature spin dash. Alright. Oi! It is I! Thanks for spending time with me today. Taking out the promise list back, taking the promise, taking out the promise list brought back memories when I worked on it with my mom. If I finished the promise list and started going to school, do you think it makes Sojiro happy? Oh hell yeah! Right? Right? Okay, that's another reason I got to work on this. I wanted to think of something I could do for Sojiro, but that's all I got for now. But first, I got to finish the promise list. Doing this alone would be like Omega Hearts, like trying to finish a solo boss. Oh, whatever. But now I got you in my party. I'm counting on you. I'm still. Let's start Phantom Quest 4 Chapters of the Phantom Thieves. Sure, we've only got a party of two, but don't worry about that. <laughs> oh well. <laughs> These game references. <laughs> okay. Hey. Alright. Did you get the data yet? No, my sister still hasn't come home. She's seriously that busy? It's probably because of us. So, uh, do you still want to go through with this? I can do it. I have a message. Sounds like she's on her way home. Alright, it's finally time. My heart's pounding. Make sure to be cautious, okay? Alright. Ooh, I can't wait to see what comes of this. Ooh, what comes of it? Ooh. We're not gonna work at the beef bowl shop because we already have maximum proficiency, but 
I think next time on Persona 5 Royal, we will max out Kawakami's confidant because she's available now. And we will see what data Makoto's sister has in store for us. See y'all then.